it may be I can just use some ribbon cable. <laughs> Let's see. So this is, this is what I've taken off. That was, I, I assume, is what was causing the issues with the, um, oh, apologies for my fingernails, causing the um, problems with the keypad. So maybe I can just, so it's 14, 14 conductors, so maybe I can just use a bit of ribbon cable. Because I'm finding it hard to get a short piece like that. So let's see. And I don't know, has anyone actually scanned these in? Well, I'm assuming not because there is, okay, it's 180 odd pages. <laughs> this is 380 odd. And then for the BP, uh, BRP4, uh, we've got 200 odd, 220. Looks like the cover, let's pull the cover back, and there's just a um, single staple holding it all together. So I might pull these apart and scan them in for posterity. I might be able to translate some of them as well. Uh, this one looks like maybe two. Anyway, just an idea, just a thought. You know, I did forget to say before is I did actually keep the box for the expansion ROM. Goes together. Very simple, very simple box. So that was the box for the expansion ROM and the um, calculator actually came with schematics. Um, which is pretty incredible. Um, not so much for Soviet Soviet stuff, but for Western stuff it would be. So you can see there, there's the keypad. A uh, little, unfortunately a little blurry, but um, I guess this has also been scanned, but um, I'll probably do a scan of this, take this down to Officeworks, get them to do an A3 scan, full-size scan. For posterity. Yeah. Cool. Okay, wrong. Yeah, anyway. Anyway, anyway. So, yeah, let's see. Let's see. Okay, I've started making the replacement for this. Don't know if it'll work. But, um, Bit by bit, I'm going to do it like this, I think. So, oh, I need to look it up. Can't remember who told me in the comments. Rotate at 90 degrees, and it's much easier. Of course, I'm just trying to do it on camera here. <laughs> it's a little bit more awkward, but yeah, certainly is much easier. There you go, I took a little bit too much off then. Okay. And then I've just been tinning them as I go as well so that I don't get these strands like that floating all over the place. So I think I'll do it for both ends and then hopefully this will be a um, suitable replacement. That one's done. Just need to tidy that one up. That one's gone all splay. Don't twist them together. So that's kind of what I'm doing at the moment.
just doing it bit by bit and um, we'll see how well it works out okay so I need to I need to um, clean these pads up a bit first but the idea is that I very carefully just solder these on that should work shouldn't it and then bend it over well, we'll try either way bend it over like that to the keyboard underneath that's the plan so well I need to clean that up first and I need to do this other end let's see so that is it <laughs> let's um, let's see if it works okay so far so good I know it doesn't look it but there is no, there are no shorts there so so far so good but when it goes in like that there might be some <laughs> because um, apparently they've never heard of conformal coating in the Soviet Union <laughs> so there's just bare tracks everywhere so I will put on I think I might make sure it's not so sharp there but I'll put on um, some tape over that to try and protect it from the other side of the circuit board so fingers crossed okay I've done the other side and it might not look it but I'll probably check it again but they are not touching each other well when I checked they weren't so USB power um, <clears throat> but it's not working so I might give it another go So, I do, <laughs> do have it in pieces, pressing the keypad, I might need to give it a bit more of a clean. Let's just press the keypad there. So, I might still need to, to check this a bit more, I think. Um, or I might just rip all that off again. And try it with maybe, I don't know, individual wires, copper wires. Not sure. Because the, the issue the issue was I couldn't find an equivalent kind of short flat film connector with four that's 14 way. That's kind of oh I'm not really sure. This is the original. Hard to tell. So I'll keep working on this. Because I definitely want to get this little thing working. It's uh, quite neat. Unfortunately, I found the problem. That's all just basically breaking up. That's why it's not working now. So... Oh, what am I going to do about that? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's a four by eight keypad. Yeah, you can see it down there, maybe. A little, yes, it's all broken up. Oh, that's a shame. But. So this should still work basically the main the main um, main board so it's just a matter of replacing the keypad and I've checked the ribbon cable my ribbon cables perfect there are no um, there's no shorts and each one buzzes through so this gives me an opportunity so it's a 4x8. I don't have any 4x8. What's that up there? 4x4. Four four. I've got 4x4 four four and 4x5 four keypads. Let me just get them. 
So yeah, so I've got four by five and four by four keypads. Pretty, not quite nice keypads actually. Um, I need four by eight. So I guess I could do two of these side by side. Hmm. Yeah, so I guess I could do two of those side by side. And um, well, I don't want to turn this upside down because all those they'll all fall out. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, so it's a four by eight. Do two of these to reproduce those. And then rehouse this in another box. So it'll be uh, Electronica Mark 52B or something. Okay, so <laughs> once again, one of these little quick projects of mine. Oh, I'll just fix this up. Uh, turns into a major bloody undertaking. You know, they, these are pretty cheap. You know, you can get them for what? I've seen them from 11 bucks to 40 bucks plus shipping. Um, that kind of defeats the purpose of, of fixing this. So, all right. I think I will try and do that. So I'm going to have to come up with the keyboard matrix which is oh, rapidly disintegrating. <laughs> uh, it would be, you know, if I did buy another one, then at least I could check the keyboard matrix. All right. All right. Watch, watch this space. To be continued.